So what's the story behind acapella? Alright, so tell me, uh, what's the story with acapella? So, uh, what's the story about acapella? Um, all I know about acapella, I don't know too much, but I know there were like a bunch of like groups before and they kind of just like disappeared over the years and no one was really like into it. Well, from what I know about acapella, there were glee clubs associated with most of the fraternities back in the 50s and 60s and they tended to be acapella and they actually had contests each year, so it was totally student run male glee club kind of singing um, and each of the fraternities would have kind of a competition. My introduction to it uh, happened in the uh, late 90s where we had a group of um, all women suddenly come together and start creating at their music. first concert. They didn't have a, a name yet. And there was another group called the Notables. They went for a few years and then their group kind of graduated and they basically asked that when their last bunch left that the name go with them. They worked uh, really well for um, about three years they, and then after the two founders graduated uh, they kept going for another two or three years but then they kind of um, uh, diminished and, and disappeared. They often had joint concerts. In my own time when I was in high school, there was a group called the Stairwells, and they were named mostly for the stairwells here in Miller because the first part of the Miller building was built and opened in 95, 96, and everybody discovered there were all these cool places and kind of secret stairwells that didn't really go anywhere. And so there was this men's acapella group, kind of a small thing. The male group rehearsed in the huge stairwell in um, uh, Miller, you know, the, the, the big echoey one. Mm -hmm. And so they called themselves the stairwells. And they were the first real like acapella group at Alfred, I think in the sense that we normally think of it. The stairwells outlasted the notables by about four years. The more thing that happened um, as the stairwells kind of dissipated and so did the Notables. Um, they joined together at one point and uh, were in contact with a really fine a cappella group in Ithaca called the Sons of Pitches. <laughs> Is that a great name? So this group now very practiced and six years in and doing their own arrangements came to Alfred and there was a joint concert with Stairwells, Notables, and the Sons of Pitches. Those guys all graduated things kind of, I think, ebbed and died out. That was kind of the last easy contact I had with um, acapella for quite a while because I went on sabbatical and then, you know, all that sort of thing. But I thought they were great. And I love acapella music. Um, there was a group called Lady Eight because there was a group of women on campus who said, hey, we would like to do this too. Um, and so we had a four to eight part women's group. As these things kind of ebb and flow, the acapella thing kind of hit a peak and sort of ebbed on out. The acapella society came together a couple of years ago to say, we may not have enough people to have two ensembles that are men's and women's, but maybe we can join together and have a, a co-ed acapella society. But I guess a couple of years ago, um, Aubrey, our president right now, like really started to try and get it going. And last year there wasn't very like good attendance or anything and people didn't really care as much, but like this year I think we're trying to bring it back. And I think it's been that way since. I don't think there's much of single sex acapella really offering on campus now, but it's much more blended group. Now I know that you're very active in an acapella group. I think it'd be cool to have like a guys group, a girls group, and maybe like a mixed group. It would just like, I don't know, promote the, promote singing more. It just seems to uh, fluctuate, but, but there's always this kind of interweaving and in the maintaining of the tradition. I have hopes for acapella. I think it's coming along nicely. Acapella's great. <laughs> Oh, well.